Hey Taurus, welcome to your November reading. So the first thing that I'm picking up here is that somebody is going through a period right now where they're really contemplating leaving a situation here. I feel like somebody feels like they're no longer wanting <clears throat> to work with somebody anymore. I feel that somebody is feeling very burdened and trapped. I feel like, you know, there hasn't been very much growth in this situation for a long time. And I feel like, you know, with the Wheel of Fortune here, with the Four of Cups, with the Eight of Cups all lined up, I feel like somebody knows now that this situation has to end. I feel like they're walking away, but at the same time, it's like they still have this hope. But I feel like this person, whoever I'm talking to, either you or the other person, I feel like, you know, somebody's cup here is empty. But somebody is still holding out to hope. You know, they're still seeing this person as the one, but it's like somebody is just not happy and it's like they don't want to wait anymore and they want to walk away from this situation. But it's like the more that they try to move on the more stuck they feel. It's like somebody's having a really hard time here. Let's see what's with the Eight of Cups here. I just want to see like who this person in the Eight of Cups, like what are they walking towards? Or what are they walking away from? But there's like still a lot of hope here. The Eight of Cups with the Knight of Swords. I think right here, I don't know if I'm picking up on another scenario or it's just something into the mix. I feel like in a situation here, somebody has walked away from somebody I feel like this was a quick judgment call and I feel like this person is coming back somebody that has once walked away is coming back and I feel like this person is coming in quick and when they come in they're coming in with a lot of communication like clarity I feel like reg regret with this person yeah, they want to offer something that is stable. Because we're seeing the Eight of Cups with the Knight of Swords with the Ace of Pentacles. Somebody in this scenario has walked away. And I feel like a lot of regret with this walk, this person walking away. I feel like it was a quick acting judgment call. And it's like, there's regret here. Like, they jumped too quick. And now it's like this person's coming in. And they're coming in quick. And they're... Wanting to offer something that is of value, like stability. Yeah, this person is definitely coming in with an offer here with the Page of Cups. You know, I feel like that's a different scenario than what I started out on. Let's see what we get here. What's with that Ace of Cups? Because we have the Ace of Cups next to the star. And I feel like in the first scenario that the cup is empty. You know, and they're still holding on to hope, but right now they don't have much hope left. And, you know, with the Wheel of Fortune above it the, and the Eight of Cups, it's, this person's going to walk away in this other scenario. But for others of you, Somebody that has once walked away that had regret, 
with the Four of Cups next to the Eight of Cups. This person is coming back with the Nine of Swords. But storming through here. But I want to see what I can get here with the Ace of Cups. And the Eight of Swords is next to it, so somebody's feeling very trapped in their feelings, their emotions. They're wanting a new beginning, but I feel like this person is carrying a lot of burdens. I feel like they're in a situation that they're not happy in, and they're wanting to come forward to build and work with you. I feel like they have contemplated this for a lot of time, but I feel like this person is, ha is coming in with some baggage, like... Uh, this person is going to reveal things that you're not aware of, but they're really feeling bogged down and burdened by their thoughts, and they're wanting to express this to you. I feel like with the Three of Wands here with the Strength card, I feel like this person is at their crossroads in their life right now. I feel like um, it's taking a lot of strength. They're a little hesitant to come forward, but I feel like this person definitely is going to come forward. There's going to be a lot of communication here. It's taking a lot of um, strength on their part. I feel like they're going to feel like judged from you. They're not knowing what to expect because they're looking at you as the empress. They're looking at you as somebody that's very stable and strong. I feel like this person has walked away and they're coming in with a lot of regret because you have moved on and they see that you have gained a lot of growth. It's like they're looking at you on the outside as somebody that's very like, you know, spiritual. You're... You're like a butterfly, like, you're like, they see you as, like, I don't even know how to say it, like, a goddess, like, there's growth, there's, it's like your energy is clear and pure, and it's like, they're coming in with all this baggage, and it's like, they're wondering how they maneuver, how they talk to you about this, and we have the hair font here with the four of wands and I th kind of feel like they're thinking that there might be somebody else involved with you but they're not really caring about that like it may cause a little bit of conflict but this person is going to come forward it's like they can't live with the burden of not knowing like what can happen here in this situation they want to see where this can go they're wanting to offer you a cup of love they're wanting to have this connection with you and you know they're gonna take that leap of faith like the cards that are all lined up here are all very positive they're all showing that there's growth in this situation we have the fool with the lovers with the king of cups with the six of wands you know and we have the nine of wands here and I feel like this is why they're a little apprehensive they're a little worried and we have the strength next to that with the eight of wands, with the empress, with the hair font, with the four of wands, with the five of wands, with the knight of cups. And that's where, you know, this is going. Like, this person is coming in. They're ready to come in, you know. They're a little fearful, a little afraid, but they're going to do it. They're gaining the courage to come forward to you. They want this new beginning. They're ready for this new beginning. Um... I don't have the Five of Pentacles here, but I feel like this person is kind of feeling out in the cold or feeling some kind of loss. They feel like, almost like you forgot about them. It's like you just moved on and you don't think of this person anymore. That's how they're feeling. Yeah. And we have the Two of Swords here with the Ten of Cups. This person is making a decision to be happy. They are going after that Ten of Cups. They're offering that cup to you. They are finally making the decision to come forward and build something with you. That's what I see here. So that is your reading for this month. I hope you enjoyed it and good luck. Thanks. Bye.